looking around a little bit. Aha! I found the sapphire and silver mask. Good for me. So, the zombies, I guess, are the ones that made these, like... These jangly bits. Because they worship the idol. <laughs> you two should realize by now that I plan for every contingency. Now drop your weapons. Down there. No heroics, please. Or I will kill her. Good. Now, if you'll just hang tight, we'll be with you in a moment. It's magnificent. The craftsmanship. I've never seen anything like it before. Don't touch that it, it'll die. Shell. The real treasure of El Dorado lies inside. <laughs> Open it! Is he, like, baiting him? How does this work? Is it evil spirits? Like a Wendigo? Oh <laughs> Maybe. That seems very evil spirity. Watch this. Oh yeah, he knew. I like how he had the foresight to close it before. So little imagination. <laughs> Navarro, that thing wiped out an entire colony. You don't know what you're doing. Wrong. I'm the only person on this island who knows what the hell he's doing. Gotta get lost that one. Cuidado! You are so pathetic. All of you. Scrambling around for your petty treasures. Do you have any idea what this is worth? To the right buyer? Levantalo! Levantalo! Huh? Oh no, what the hell is that? Oh, zombies, Sully, they're zombies. Uh, hey. Jesus, what are those things? It's the Spaniards, Sully. They never left. I like the way he said that. that. That's like almost a trailer line. My God, if that thing gets off the island, you gotta stop him. I'll cover you from here. I remember this part being kind of cool, but I also wouldn't be surprised if I screwed up because of the difficulty setting. <laughs> okay, uh, turns out you don't want to be in the water. Nate just kind of like casually swims and then dies. I guess I need to go around. This is probably... Ah, I got stuck on Navarro's body. Not Navarro, Navarro's the other guy. Whoever that guy was. Should've picked up the ammo. So this is probably... Oh, should've kept shooting, actually. This is probably the closest thing to, like, a set piece that the game has, I would say. Which makes sense that it would be at the end here. And obviously I'm screwing it up. So as soon as I see it, dude, I need this. Ah, damn it! I, like, barely even saw him. I pressed the trigger button, but it was too soon. Kind of, yeah, what I expected, really shitting up the scene by having this happen. But, like, this is uh, very good as a just, you know, this is end point. Things are getting wild. Get out of my way. Don't know how much, uh... I uh, tried to preempt him, but then I shot way too soon because he he really is finagling me, and I hate seeing this cutscene over and over again. I say, look at this set piece, and then I'm just struggling here. 
I don't even know. I don't think we can actually slow down. Like, I think we need to try to hurry. Got him that time. Hopefully there's no more gunmen. Because we had to get to this. Which, honestly, I also remember that whole thing being a lot longer. Like, we were chasing this down. But I guess they were just pulling it out of the hole. That was... Wait, was that the hole that we saw... That whole time? We could have just jumped down there and there was treasure? It didn't even look like it was a big hole. Don't shoot the treasure! Oh no! But I don't know, I, I think it's neat trying to jump onto the... The giant gold idol. I remember it being a bit more... Crazy than just having a hard time with one shotgun lad. Now this... I remember being kind of weird. We also don't have grenades anymore. We're not allowed. We only have our shotgun. That's not how that should have played out. We're, we're pretty limited with what we can do here. The main thing is that the cover will disappear. These guys go down a bit easier than usual, at least. And he has like a weird gun. I think like our main thing is we just have to deal with the other enemies that come in. It's like, it's a really awkward boss fight, is what this is. And I was never really the biggest fan of it. I guess, oh god, especially when loads of guys are showing up. He, he's shooting his own men! I actually don't even rem remember the ads. I think there's a more specific this is the end where you fight only him part. And if I remember right, you're kind of forced into... Okay, I guess you can kill me from the cover I was in. Damn it. I think you were forced into like a very specific cover. Did I break his cover? Doesn't really seem like it. I mean, I am, but it takes so long, and I... Seems like a decent idea, if only because he bailed on me. Here we go. You looked like you were ready to throw a grenade, but I guess you didn't. I know I'm running out of ammo, but it's not like we're gonna run back over here. Try to play it a little safer, I guess. Go with this immediately. Max out my ammo. really good at breaking your cover. Yeah, this is a little scummier. 
it's, it's kind of cool that Navarro's like here in the fray, but you can't really do much about him besides just trying your best. And he'll bail once all of his ads are gone. Oh, he just holds his hand out weird. I'm actually doing really awful. I'm going to try something. It's probably not going to be a great option, but I'm going to try it. They gave us a shotgun. Let's just... No! Seems like I made a mistake. Try again. I think, uh... Navarro ends up shooting us way too quickly. I feel like the idea here is that each of these are specific gun zones. Because I don't think they really drop shotguns for you in, um... Okay, you're gonna kill me. They don't really drop shotguns for you in the next area. Didn't think he would get rid of my cover that quickly. I don't know. I would love for you to not be in that cover you're in, buddy. Oh shit! Okay, I don't. I cannot stay out of cover. He's, his gun's way too strong, way too meaty. I shimmy around. He kind of seems to not do a good job. Never mind. Of shooting out my cover, I said being entirely wrong. I wonder if over here would just be safer. Not when you're... Not when I don't shoot you. It would be safer in terms of just not... having my cover getting blown out. Is he dead? No. Okay, wait a minute. I think there's only the one guy left, so we'll just take it slow here. Well, misses. I, mm, I, I think that's still a good spot. It's just that I think by that point, when he starts circling to try to get me, probably should have um actually went full aim mode. That worked out pretty well. All right, now he's bailing. Back to the second part that I was struggling with. They give me M. They give me M4 ammo pretty early on. I can't really start shooting over here. I don't know if there's cover back there, which is a little scary. guy left, so if I could just get you out of here, maybe... I'm out of ammo again. Oh! My cover! Mmm! Bit of a problem here, isn't it? I'm dead. There's no way. 
Almost got into cover. Ah, oh, that sucks. Uh, I don't know the best way to go about dealing with that. I guess I have to actually try to go for headshots, but I'm not great with the assault rifle. You're not dead! Dude! I know I didn't, like, shoot his head or anything. Maybe I should try aiming. Maybe aiming would help. Aiming might actually help a lot. Because once I actually aim for the head, that just actually hits. So, uh... Maybe we'll try that. Don't really give me enough time when the cover goes away either. You're not dead. Seemed seemed like a lot of shots that should have just dealt with you, buddy. I wait for my health. Okay, we at least have a lot more shotgun ammo, which hopefully will just mean that we can deal with more enemies if I get better shots off. Changes things. It's a whole new game now. Uh, Navarro will definitely not leave his hidey hole, I'm pretty sure. have to risk it, but I don't... Oh, that's bullshit. I mean, that's a good solution. Yeah, he'll, like, insta-kill me. I, I don't even think he really, like, he didn't have a bead on me, did he? Because I don't... I don't feel like he would have, like... It would have been like a, I could have dodge rolled out of the way before he got me situation. I don't feel like that anyways. I could be wrong. I do like that he can hurt his own men though. Okay, well I knowing that I can bail is great. Did those guys just start spawning way sooner? Because usually I have to kill, like, everyone for them to show up. Yeah, this is basically why I remember not liking this section. I feel like I'm, yeah, I'm dead right now because that guy came running. I feel like this might have been how I had to deal with this the first time around too. 
don't know how I get lucky sometimes with my shotgun. Blast. And then sometimes I just don't. Thought maybe the three hits would be good enough, but apparently not. He basically does three and then... Three and then one extra, and I know that he was going to go for the one extra, but I panicked because the one guy was coming at me. Hell, I'd be happy if these guys threw grenades. Don't stand out when he's doing that. I think it's the, um... Has to be like the one shot at the end is probably what kills me. Hmm. I guess that guy too can kill me. Was I low health? Or did he get lucky? I don't know what's hitting me right now. Getting uh, worse as we progress, which is always a fun thing to do. I might have bad um, health when... I think the guy went for his brap 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 and then another one. I might have bad health and I'm not noticing because of the, like, weather. Makes me think that this is just how it looks. Well, he kind of just came into my spot. But that kind of worked out for me. This is one of those things, too, that's supposed to be very cinematic. But just doesn't really work out. In my opinion. Of course, you can always say it's because I'm bad. I'm gonna jump in and jump out. They might spawn in when I come out. Yeah. You can kind of see with how quickly I whipped the camera that they, um... They were just standing there. I think they'll stay in cover, though. That's the problem. You guys kind of just decided to come in. I don't know what triggers them. There's at least two normal guys left. Appreciate you walking up a little bit. At least one normal guy left. The problem is where he is. Mr. I have red lines. And still screw me up. That was a great way to deal with that. Hopefully it checkpoints or something. Scummy way 
Of course, it wouldn't be uh, me playing Uncharted if I didn't scum my way through by... by a turtling. Like, there's just a whole nother one right here. Oh! Um, hmm. Please say that was a checkpoint. Thank God. Because I don't think I had a chance. They, like, immediately killed... I would have been really angry about that. They, like, absolutely immediately shot me down. Probably should really be aiming. Aiming really helps. But at the very least, I did checkpoint. So that's all that really matters for me. And I'm out of ammo. I was safe. I don't know what I was trying to do. I'm dead. Yeah. Like I said, though, I'm not nearly as peeved as I would have been, so... Yeah, I really need to aim. I don't know why I think that not aiming is going to work when it clearly is not. That, like, oh my god, that works so much better. I'm stupid. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't have tried to get up when I was very clearly getting shot at, though. That is also stupid. I hate it. I hate how much I'm getting shot at immediately. He just doesn't seem to be able to really deal with... Cool. <sighs> Damn it, I thought I was trying to suppress fire. Alright, so that guy's there, but... He doesn't seem to be able to really aim unless if it's the fourth shot. So I need to just make sure I'm behind cover by the time he shoots four times. I might as well get rid of you. Okay, we're moving on. I think up here is the last spot. I struggled a bit. And then this is like, I think this is very scripted. There's something weird about how this plays out, I remember. I was gonna say, yeah, hide behind the exploding barrels. Oh crap, now what? Here we go. <laughs> I guess it's really silly, isn't it? We just had to go behind those covers to get a uh Just so we can get up to him. It wasn't actually that bad, but it, I, it's, it's goofy. And I think we have to do it again. If I didn't dodge roll, I feel like I could have totally done that. Let me try to actually rush him down. If not, then I would assume I have to hide behind the uh, relic. El Dorado itself. Yeah, we just have to go after him. He might also be dead now, so it's over. 
We did it! We killed that guy that was in the game. <laughs> Hey, I got charted easy, if you weren't aware. Maybe we beat the game? Chart it normal? Let's go. Chart it hard. And maybe a mistake, but I got charted crushing. And we don't have to worry about that, uh... Death Trap Treasure ever again, turning people into zombie vampires. Quite a day. Yeah, yeah, save the world, triumph over evil. Pretty typical. <laughs> really? That's a shame we're leaving empty handed, though. Oh, well, you know, I, I did manage to save one small thing. Here, I. I thought you might miss this. Thanks. Yeah. You two got a funny idea of romantic. <laughs> Sully! Wow, you you look like hell. You should see the other guys. <laughs> got us a boat. Uh, we already have a boat. Yeah, big boat. <laughs> <laughs> I like this one better. <gasps> Son, I can send my son to college son now. Of a bitch. Barred it off a couple of pirates who were too dead to care. <laughs> Sorry you didn't get your story. No, uh, that's all right. Now the other stories. You still owe me one. <laughs> I'm good for it. We did it! Get me off this crushing island. The beautiful sunset. All of that took place in a day. So that was Sun Chart at Drake's Fortune. Which wasn't really Drake's Fortune, it was... Evil bioweapon cursed thing that Drake was like, nah, I don't want none of that shit. But we we beat the game on crushing. Maybe it was a mistake to try crushing difficulty. I don't know how different it is on other difficulty settings, but um, being one shot at by people with Wesses and shotguns, not the funnest thing ever. But I do remember I also struggled on easy mode, so I feel like there is still probably some problems with the difficulties in general. Um, it's a bit rough, Uncharted Drake's Fortune. It is, I think it's a fine game. I guess I wouldn't say maybe mediocre if it wasn't for the fact that the characters themselves are fun enough and it does really have that adventure, Indiana Jones, National Treasure, The Mummy style of fun to it, which is enjoyable. Last Minute Zombies was pretty cool. We got to hang out and be friends with Eddie for a moment before he got dragged into the abyss with the zombie nose. But, um, I think I remember the other games kind of interspersed the combat rooms with, like, set pieces and story a bit better. There was a lot of, I, I, again, it was me being bad at the game, me playing on crushing that kind of caused some issues. But I feel like there was a lot of combat zones that kind of dragged on too long, and there wasn't really... Usually with, I guess with a combat zone, I would at least want some thing a bit more, like, story-related or important to be happening when we're in the combat zone, not just, like, sliding through the customs house, which really has nothing to do with anything. It's just where they had the boat. Like, going... Customs house was probably the hardest area that I had to deal with. But then again, all of the other areas I basically cheesed by turtling around. I don't remember if the other games, it's easier to turtle. I remember when I played Uncharted 4, I did a lot more running and gunning, but I think the uh, levels worked better for that. Um, and I remember specifically there was an, 
a part in Uncharted 2 that I turtled like hell once I found a way to cheese it. But we'll, we'll see that when we get there. Um, but I mean, like the gunplay is fine. It's just nothing to write home about. So obviously the main appeal is the story, which I think was fun enough. But uh, I, I think it gets a little more exciting when we progress past this game because Uncharted 2 is great. And I know Uncharted 3 kind of has some problems that we'll get to when we get there, but I think that one also has some fun stuff too. And Uncharted 4 is kind of a, a bit more different. It, it's a little bit more low-key, kind of like this game, I guess, but it's still fun. They're, they're all fun games. I never played Golden Abyss or Lost Legacy, which was a, not, I don't know if you'd say a spin-off, but I never played those ones. I don't know about Golden Abyss, because that's, you know, Vita game, gotta get Vita controls in there. But I'm sure Lost Legacy's fun enough. I think I just didn't want to play it because it was, like, sold as a standalone game, and I'm like, I don't know if I feel like doing that right now, which is beside the point. Uh, crushing difficulty, just, yeah, the one-shot kills were annoying. But, uh, we dealt with it when we dealt with it. And I guess this is my quote-unquote redemption for playing this on easy when I first beat it. Even if it was <laughs> a rough redemption. <laughs> but I had, I had fun with it, so... And we didn't have to worry about using the six-axis controls to throw grenades, which is a godsend, because... I think I would have had a harder time throwing grenades than I already did if we had to worry about that. That was completely removed from all other Uncharted games after one, though. Obviously, the remake removed it, but when it was released on PlayStation 3, they did not have those gross motion controls. And I got like two thirds of the treasures, which is pretty good. And I got the Dragon Sniper trophy, which means I don't have to worry about that anymore. I think for like all of those, it would just be go to chapter select to where you could find that weapon, kill people, let yourself die and kill people again and just do that. I never put the effort to, uh, to get those trophies because I also would have had to put the effort for the difficulty trophies. Post credit. Post credit. Eddie's okay. I don't know why, I thought maybe there would be a post-credit where Eddie gets out of the pit and is like, I'm okay! I'm okay! There's some... Bonuses? Reward bonuses? Skins? Disabled? Can't be enabled from the main menu. Let's go to a... Play the game. So I guess this unlocks another harder difficulty. I think, what is it, Grounded? Because that's what Last of Us had. We'll uh, skip the movie. And then we will look at our bonus rewards. What weapon select do we have? I don't know what determines what we can get. Eddie's gun. Oh, brutal. I guess that makes sense then. They tell us exactly what we need to do. We need to collect this many treasures. I probably should have just read that. Brutal difficulty for golden. I wonder if that's like uh, infinite ammo or something. Or maybe it's just strong enough. But, I mean, we, we unlocked a lot of these, so we could always just, I think, select them to get trophies if we wanted to. Render mode is render mode, black, white, sepia. Next gen filter? Oh, that's a joke on all of the, like, brown grossness next gen games had. Concept arts. We can only view those from the menu. Tweaks. Slow-mo. Slow-mo would actually... And one-shot kills and infinite ammo. I don't know if we could turn these on on Brutal. I think you could to get the crushing difficulty if you wanted to. Which clearly would make things a lot easier. I wonder if they uh, disabled them on, on Brutal difficulty though. Because obviously killing people instantly is great. Unless if it works against you as well. But it's Brutal mode. It probably would have one-shot at you anyways. And slow motion would help you to be able to aim better can really cheese the system what's baseball shirt drake i don't <laughs> oh drake what happened oh i think how the hell they find us out here it's just like casual it's a nice shirt I wouldn't I have called him. it a baseball shirt but okay kind of did some weird uh, texture things but that's not the most important thing 
most important thing is that we have why is this disabled is it because we're in combat get me out of combat restart checkpoint most important thing is we have donut drake which look at this guy look at him I can't go into photo mode. Look at him. Do you ever get used to this? I never get used to it, Elena. Having a rough time. Oh Ugh. 